your boy, Lionheart, and I'm back. Oh boy. Monster Hunter? The official trailer? Bro. I am ready. I'm ready, man. Let's get it. Wow, okay. Military? Phones? Why am I seeing military and phones for? Captain, do you have any idea what those markers are? They look pretty ancient. The tracks end here. It's definitely Bravo team. They don't just disappear. T.I., my man! Video, okay. Move, move. Where the hell are we? That lightning, it hit those markers and it took us somewhere. Wow. Guys! So what? Are we like Guardians of the Galaxy now? On our six! Diablos. Diablos! Diablos! Officially above my pay grade. Okay, okay. I don't care what those creatures are. We got the great sword. And close the gateway. Yeah. Yeah. I'm getting us all home. I don't know about that. I don't know about rocking on the Okay, yeah, I'm about to say, rocking on the work on the bathroom. Oh, there he is. The Raffian or Rathalos. No, that was the Blue Raffian, actually. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. Um, man. I'm a bit conflicted about that. Uh, wow. It was a lot to take in. It was nice to see the Monster Hunter um, monsters. You know, we saw Diablos. We saw Raphalos. And uh, I think we saw at the beginning the green Raphian. And then that I think that was the blue Raphian. And we saw Raphalos. You know, so that's pretty cool. I don't know about all that military stuff, man. Now, in a Monster Hunter world, it looks like they got teleported, you know, to Asteria. So that looks pretty cool. But, I, I mean... Bro, we'll see. We'll see. Kind of looks like a Blu-ray movie, to be honest with you. I mean, it was. It's nostalgic and nice to see the world. You know, so it looks like Monster Hunter's already there. Man, the more I'm starting to think about it, the more I'm kind of getting like. You know, I always want to give them a fair shake, yeah, because those guys they did give us Event Horizon. Yeah, and Resident Evil 1, right? The first movie. The second movie is, it was decent. It was all right. It, it suited its time. This kind of looked like a little bit dated. That is, it looks it looks all right, I guess. But it looks like it belongs in like 2008. You know what I mean? But, you know, that's what we've got to expect from um, the husband, you know, of Milia, right? Because every movie he does these days, he just puts his wife in them, right? So we always know what to expect right there. Uh, yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, I'm not blown away like I thought I was going to be blown away. It's just kind of like the, the military kind of like deflated me. And like the, using the rocket launcher. And machine guns. You know. Or like Diabolos and Raffian. I didn't buy it. I just was looking at it. I don't buy it. I don't, I don't know what's wrong with it. It looked like the graphics look good. Like the monsters look very well done. But something about it just kind of... I didn't believe what I was seeing. You know, like you see like a sparse desert. And then all you see... Diablos just comes out of it. Out, comes out of the floor. Which is... Diablos, right? I mean, we'll see. We'll see. You know, Monster Hunter Man. <sighs> Mate. I would like to have seen just Asteria, you know, and the whole world of Monster Hunter, but it looks like they ain't gonna do it. It's gonna be like a military people teleported to, you know, the Monster Hunter world of Asteria. And they're just going to be hunted by, you know, Raphalos and Raffian and Diablos. And they're going to be killing off the monsters. And it's going to be like, you know, corny um, action set pieces. You know, where they run away and they set up a trap and then they get it, barrage it with stuff. And I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it did, it did, it did look a little bit dated. Yeah, it looked like it belonged like 2007, 2008. You know, maybe 2009. Nah, 2007, 2008. Yeah, but yeah. I mean, it's all right. It's all right, but we'll see. So, Warriors, please, I want to know what you guys thought of that trailer. If you watched it with me. You know, if you watch it yourself, yeah, in HD. Yeah, like I just did. Uh, I'd love to know what you guys think, right? Uh, so, I'll say in summary... I kind of felt my height meter decreasing with every scene because I felt like I was looking at a weird version of Resident Evil and I'm a bit gassed. I mean, I said I always want to give them a fair shake because of Event Horizon and Resident Evil 1 and 2, right? But I did feel myself getting a little bit gassed from it. Warriors, over to you. Please, um, comment section, keep liking, sharing, subscribing my videos. You know, we're almost monetized. You know, I've got a thousand more hours uh, to be watched on my whole channel. So if you guys watch my videos, right, you know, I really appreciate it. You know, I'm at 3,000 hours watched on my channel within 12 months. So all I need is a thousand more hours watched of my videos. I'll be monetized. Let's get it. Warriors, take care, stay blessed, and I'll be doing more videos, so please stay tuned.